Oof. Well, ladies and gentlemen, let's try to refocus. We got an Intercontinental Championship Eliminator on hand. The winner of this matchup gonna be on their way to Saturday night's main event this weekend in the ATL to decide who goes on to fight LA Knight for the Intercontinental Gold at the grandest stage of them all. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring, accompanied by Trick Williams from Boston, Massachusetts, weighing in at 210 pounds, Carmelo Hayes. Let us take you back to last week and the first matchup in the Intercontinental Championship Eliminator, the big strong boy, Tyler Bate, and the black heart, Tommaso Ciampa, leaving it all inside the squared circle and a stellar performance on both sides of the ring. In the end, Tyler Bate, Tyler Bate ever impressive, but unfortunately for him, Tommaso Ciampa was just the better man. As you will see, the attempt with the fairy tale ending, the second one delivered in the contest, was all that Ciampa needed to make his way to Atlanta this Saturday night. Ciampa awaits the winner of this contest between Carmelo Hayes and Sami Zayn with an Intercontinental Championship opportunity at WrestleMania hanging in the balance. And his opponent from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 212 pounds, Sami Zayn. Well, Sami Zayn has been laser focused on becoming the Intercontinental Champion since the fall here on Monday Night Raw. He has ran it with LA Knight before. It was back on Halloween night when Raw emanated from Dublin, Ireland, and Sami Zayn pushed LA Knight to his absolute limits on that night, but the defiant champion, unfortunately, was just the better man. Sami Zayn has scratched and clawed to try to earn another opportunity for the Intercontinental Championship. There has been a couple of wrinkles in the road. Sami Zayn has ran in to Solo Sokoa. He has ran into other superstars, chasing Intercontinental Championship opportunities. But now Sami Zayn finds himself with the ultimate opportunity. One of four, now three superstars that competes in the Intercontinental Championship Eliminator. Sammy looking to make it two superstars. Well, here we go. High stakes, high reward. Here in New Orleans, Louisiana on Monday Night Raw, Zayn and Carmelo locking horns for the first time ever. Zayn going for the pinfall early, not to be denied, is Carmelo Hayes. Remember what happened just a few weeks ago? LA Knight victorious over our truth here on Raw, and Sami Zayn marched his way down the aisle, stepped right into the squared circle, and went face to face with the Intercontinental Champion. Zayn reminding LA Knight what Zayn's story has all been about over the last couple of months, retracing his steps back to becoming the number one contender. However, Sami Zayn, as we mentioned, not the only one who is eyeing up an Intercontinental title matchup on the grandest stage of them all. Tommaso Ciampa making his way through Tyler Bate, the Blackheart, now awaits the winner of this matchup at Saturday Night's Main Event this weekend. And I'll tell you, no matter who wins this contest between Melo and Sami Zayn, I will put my money right now on Tommaso Ciampa possibly being the favorite. Remember back in the fall, in that deadly games eliminator to go on a Survivor Series and challenge for the WWE Championship, Tommaso Ciampa outlasted that eliminator and won the finals at Saturday night's main event against the Celtic warrior Sheamus. Lightning may be striking twice this weekend, and whether it's Zayn or Mello, Champa's gotta be going in the favorite. And it may be Mello as he soars over the top rope. All speculation, but Carmelo Hayes not looking to find out if his Intercontinental Championship aspirations will fizzle out here tonight or this weekend. Melo's looking to get through Sami Zayn, get through Tommaso Ciampa, and head towards a matchup with the Megastar. Sami Zayn came out hot in the opener, but Carmelo Hayes turned this matchup on its head. We have talked about in great lengths, Carmelo Hayes and even Trick Williams at ringside, two future pieces of really the top Top positions, if you will, here on Monday Night Raw. Melo's going to be a future main eventer, no doubt about it. But he's got to start getting the W's in these big time matches. Sami Zayn trying to flip the switch on Carmelo Hayes. Wait a minute. First 48 delivered. Melo with the double knees. And that is a huge maneuver in the early going of this matchup. 
Sami Zayn feeling it right on the button. Melo needed a, anything to get him out from that back against the wall position. Sami Zayn was unloading. Melo went to the book. Was one of his best maneuvers in there. Sami Zayn doing the same. Big time exploder. Zayn scaling the ropes and dropping the elbow. Melo Hayes in recent weeks, you go back to the day one edition of Monday Night Raw on January the 1st. Melo went toe to toe in a great matchup with the Rated R Superstar Edge. He tore it up with CM Punk in Los Angeles, California a number of weeks ago as well. The 2v2 matchup, Melo and Trick versus Punk and Nakamura. Carmelo has hung with some of the best of them, but he needs to start, start scoring the pinfalls. And Sami Zayn, I'll tell you, not looking for that to start tonight. Little bit of hesitation there. Goes for the crossbody. Carmelo Hayes, the younger, possibly more agile at this age superstar. One step ahead of the veteran. Carmelo Hayes better keep his eye on the ball because Sami Zayn will make him pay. Here we go. Melo getting dropped on the apron. Never count out Sami Zayn. He has made a career out of being the ultimate underdog, and he will do so again if need be. And dropping Mello right on the apron, or excuse me, right on the barricade that time. Doing that maneuver right after falling on the apron. That's just adding insult to injury. Those maneuvers gonna start to stack up, I'll tell you. Mello back inside the squared circle where Sami Zayn is awaiting him. Mello in trouble right now, being brought to the top rope, not by will, but by force. Zane going for a little Frankensteiner, and it lands flushing. Oh, wait a minute here. You had to know this was going to happen eventually. Trick Williams taking Sami Zayn's eye off the ball, and it pays Mello dividends. Trick Williams continues to get involved, continues to stick his nose where it doesn't belong, and that may be... The X Factor that awards Carmelo Hayes a position in this weekend's Eliminator Finals. Not just yet, but definitely Sami Zayn has got to keep his eye on Trick Williams at ringside. Zayn in the corner and Melo making him pay. We could be seeing the coming out party of the Trick Melo gang before our very eyes. If Carmelo Hayes can get through Sami Zayn tonight, Get through another veteran, Tommaso Ciampa, on Saturday. Melo will be on his way for a one-on-one -on -one first time ever meeting against the megastar, L.A. Knight, for the Intercontinental Championship at WrestleMania. Oh, look at this. Float over DDT. That's a knockout blow any day of the week and twice on Monday. Melo Hayes starting to unload right now. Sami Zayn is in trouble. Now Melo's going up, and he could be looking for that slam dunk. Melo could be looking to take things home all the way to the Eliminator Finals. But Sami Zayn has not fought month in and month out to try to earn another championship opportunity to see it go by the wayside. Melo center over the top rope. Sami Zayn trying to create some distance. And as he makes his way back inside between the ropes, Zayn is there with waiting arms. Oh, here we go! Blue Thunder Bomb! We have seen that maneuver put superstars away in the past, but Carmelo Hayes not to be denied just yet. Who is going to Saturday night's main event this weekend, live at 5 p.m. Eastern Time at State Farm Arena in Atlanta, Georgia? Tommaso Ciampa made his way through the big strong boy Tyler Bate last week. An incredible matchup, one we will not soon forget. Zayn and Carmelo Hayes looking for the same result. Melo center the corner. Sami Zayn, Haluba kick! And Zayn going for the cover. Oh, oh you gotta be kidding. Trick Williams is up on the apron. The referee's back is turned. Trick Williams trying to play X Factor once again. Finally into the cover, but Carmelo Hayes, of course, had plenty of time to recuperate. Man, Sami Zayn had it right there. Trick Williams, once again, sticking his nose where it doesn't belong. Sami Zayn gonna try to rally, but 
Well, maybe that was his best opportunity. Carmelo Hayes saved by his running buddy in the Trick Mello gang. Oh man, I don't know. I don't like this situation for Sami Zayn right now. He's doing his best to keep his foot on the gas pedal. Going to the outside with a toe pace to Asita. Carmelo Hayes down and out. Oh, wait a minute. Sami Zayn said, I'll do something about this myself. Sending Trick Williams right to the barricade. Oh, that gave time for Mello to recuperate. Sami Zayn is literally stuck between a rock and a hard place here tonight, doing all he can to try to finally earn his Intercontinental Championship opportunity, and he is fighting an uphill battle. Trick Williams trying to do anything he can, distract the referee, distract Sami Zayn, throwing a damn steel chair to the ring, as if that need is needed in this case. And again, this is absolutely ridiculous. Get Trick Williams away from ringside. Sami Zayn hit a second Huluva kick, but Sami has had enough. He's going after Trick once more and dropping him right on the hardest part of the ring. Melo playing a game of cat and mouse with Sami Zayn, but meanwhile, Trick Williams, I think, has finally bit off more than he could chew, and the referee's tossing Trick out of here. Well, Sami Zayn seeing the casualty, but he may have just become one off a second, first 48. A lot of action to keep up with in this Intercontinental Championship Eliminator. Back and forth, who will be the victor? Sami Zayn or Carmelo Hayes? Sami Zayn has thrown his best shot not once but twice. Trick Williams the reason this matchup progresses on. Trick has finally been thrown out. Long time coming if you ask me. But it may be too late. Carmelo Hayes, the aggressor at the current moment, may be making his way to Saturday night's main event. Sami Zayn down, Sami Zayn out. Carmelo Hayes looking to put the final nail in the coffin of this Intercontinental Championship Eliminator. Scaling the ropes again. Looking to go high risk, high reward. Melo does miss that time. The slam dunk nowhere to be found. Carmelo Hayes was looking to throw his best shot. Sami Zayn rejected him at the rim. And now a third Huluva kick. Melo got to be knocked out cold. Wait a minute. Referee did not see Melo's hand on the ropes. Well, we, we got to check the replay here. Carmelo Hayes, after eating three Huluva kicks, still somehow had some life left in him, reached out, grabbed the ropes to no avail. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. I guess bad luck catching up to Here Melo. Sammy. Well, I'll tell you what, when the referee checks the tape back, and so does Carmelo Hayes, there's going to be an argument behind the curtain. But at the end of the day, decision is final. Sami Zayn picking up the victory here tonight on Raw. And the Intercontinental Championship Eliminator signed and set to be delivered. Coming your way on Saturday night, April the 13th. Witness the aftermath of WrestleMania as the superstars of Monday Night Raw and Friday Night SmackDown head to San Juan, Puerto Rico for the 2024 Backlash. This international live premiere event streams live at 5 p.m. Eastern Time on Saturday night, April the 13th. And as a new season approaches, what will these superstars have in store? You haven't seen anything yet, and nothing can prepare you for the backlash.